Hi, today I'm posting a tutorial for making a flower which I've used in a mini album. For that, what you need is any white base which you're going to work on, white quilling strips, either a needle tool or a pair of tweezers or whatever you use to soften the paper. You can even use your hand and you need glue. So how you make it is you decide upon the length of the petal. I have chosen one inch here. So cut it like this, the same size. You can measure them and cut them this way. I've used 10 of them. Now in the center, soften it gently like this, just around the center apply a very very thin line of glue it's practically invisible fold it over itself and just hold for 10 seconds there within that much the paper will take grip and it will stick now I have used 10 of them Feel free to use as many as would fit in your flower. Now start joining these very carefully. Like this. There. Application of glue has to be very carefully done here. So there you see, I think there is room for one more petal. Once again, soften in the center. Apply a very thin line of glue. Fold it together. And hold precisely for 10 seconds. Now again, Apply glue and push it in. And here we are, our flower is ready. Now we just need to put glue on it carefully so that it doesn't project out of the paper when you begin to glue the onto the base. Make sure you lift off the extra glue droplets like this and here is your white base and there we go. Gently and carefully press it on there and if you see any non-uniformities just correct them before the glue takes hold. And here we are with the white on white flower. To make those central shaded veins, taper the paper very carefully like this. Now holding with the tweezers, apply glue on the edge of the paper. And very gently lower it into the petal and this is how it will create the graduated shade effect thank you and i hope you enjoy making this one